What is up guys, this is CubeWack here, and welcome back to the next episode of the Pokemon Emerald Randomized Nuzlocke. And let's start this video off with a really positive note. Love life. Love everything, love everyone, and try to look for the good in things instead of focusing on the negatives, and your quality of life will increase. Why is this up? Oh my god. Wow, that's probably- you're probably not gonna be able to see what I just did! But something happened. Alright, um, last time, we unfortunately, unfortunately, spoilers alert, I don't know why you'd watch this video before the last one, but last time we unfortunately lost our precious Ego, as you can see on the layout, and we now have Skizza, though. We now have Skizza, so maybe Ego being dead isn't all that bad. Just kidding, let me take that while I'm- I can't even take that from you. Let me take that while we're here. How do I take it though? Like, how do I keep it? Can I? Back, there we go. And we're gonna do that, and hopefully, um, that actually puts my mons. That move it? Yeah, okay. I know that if you leave it on the dead box when you're in the PC, that's where it'll send Pokemon. Didn't want that. Did not want that. But last time we lost Ego, now we have Skizza, and Skizza I actually leveled up just a little bit. Because I think at level 10 he gets another sketch or she gets another sketch so We got Skizza here who only knows rage at the moment and Is really not that great at all, but I do have hope. I do have hope that we can um, Level this thing into a beautiful beautiful little little cannon of, of death like I don't know I'm hoping we could sketch some good moves off some wild legendaries or something to just make a crazy crazy smear -well. But, yeah, that's about it for the recap. Now we're just going to keep moving forward. I didn't even make it to Petalburg Woods last episode like I had hoped to. But this episode, we are for sure going to make it there. I just realized we just took that thing on with nothing but Skizza. On accident, I did that. Oh, wow. Yeah, Victor is a lot stronger. <laughs> Victor puts in a lot more work than Skizza right now. But yeah, um, what, le how many Pokeballs do we have? How many Poke- three? We need more. I do want to point this out, it's probably not there right now, but at the bottom of the screen, every five minutes or so, um, a little question of the day pops up, and I never know what it is during the videos, I usually come up with it afterwards, but please make sure to answer the question today and let me know below, I would love to see your guys' responses to whatever I end up asking any day. Um, I'm trying to come up with good ones. Also, leave in the comments, that will be the question of the day today. Question of the day. What are some good questions that you would like to see me put, like to see me put in the question of the day? Because I really do need... Wow, that is a high-level Poochiana because it's usually a magic art. <coughs> Feels like... Felt like I got something in my throat. Out of nowhere. Sometimes that happens when you talk a lot. This is my third video I've recorded in a row. We're on a roll. First two, kind of were only the length of one usual Emerald episode, though, so. Yeah, that was definitely much needed water. Drink a lot of water. Drink a lot of water. Drink a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of water. All right, um, I feel like I had some other stuff to talk about, like just some s topics. In my head, I wanted to- Oh! I was gonna talk about how I just had a conversation for the first time in forever, uh, with my little sister. Because... I love my little sister to death. She- I see a lot of myself in her when it comes to... Oh my god, I am never going to hit this thing. Alright. I see a lot of myself in her, though, because I am a creative individual, she is a creative individual. It's probably something to do with genetics, but, um, she had, uh, she, she does art. My little sister does art, and I really want to see her, like, because she wants to do animation as a career, but right now all she's really been doing is art, and I got her a drawing tablet for Christmas. She's going to, she's going to succeed, and she's going to be a success in what she wants to do with her passion for art. I know it. I'm gonna make sure of it. I'm gonna try to help, like, keep her on the right path and stuff as she grows up. I don't know. 
what I'm gonna do exactly, but I had a talk with her for the first time in a long time about, like, all of that stuff, pretty much. And it was nice. It was nice. I haven't really... I kind of grew distant in, in the time away from YouTube. I, I grew very distant from, um... From my family. Not, like, very, very, very super... Like, I don't come home anymore and stuff like that. But it's just, like... I kind of I kind of didn't talk to anybody around the house because I was not only was I never home but I didn't really like feel like talking to anybody around the house per se. Oh my god, that scared me. I know his rage. See, my rage is building, so my attack is up two stages right now. But I'm also in like a predicament because I could die and I have no healing items. So, we're going to have to switch. I have no choice but to switch because I don't want to risk anything with Skizza that I don't need to. Like, that's... That is pointless. But... Yeah, I mean, I just kind of... The whole reason I'm back on YouTube is not only because I miss it and I wanted... I, I got the urge, finally, to come back. And I was like, it's time! But, oh my god, she gave cash. We're going straight to get Pokeballs and a few healing items. But, um... Also, if they're... Never mind. Um, the whole reason I came back to YouTube is kind of because I was... I was at the point where I was trying to better myself. And just... I, I've talked about this in the, like, video saying I was coming back. But I wanted to better myself. I wanted to just go back to being the person I used to be that I liked. And so it was just like... I let myself get lazy. I honestly let myself get lazy. All my creativity was just kind of not there... I was just not, I was just, I was not paying attention to what I should have been doing. And I kind of looked at what had been going on one day and I was like, you know what? Like, I need to go back, like, I need to kind of figure out Waterstone is beautiful item to get at this point in the game. I was just telling, like, I need to, I need to know what I'm, I need to get back into doing important things, productive things, stuff like this. So immediately after that, and I kind of started thinking differently, there is Matang. That is my first encounter, is it? Isn't it? That is my Petalburg Woods. That is so beautiful. We're never going to catch this thing because I totally forgot to buy Pokeballs. I totally forgot to buy Pokeballs. Alright, well, I'm gonna look at the bright side here with probably not catching this Matang. And that is, it would take forever to level up anyways because it's a pseudo. That's all I gotta say. Grinding would suck. I don't like grinding. Which is why I like Altaria a lot because Altaria's level curve is so, like, easy to level up. And I'm just like, yes. I can't really hurt it. I'm scared to hurt it. So we're just gonna... Oh my god, come on. You stupid Matang. Alright. Going our last Pokeball. If it doesn't catch, it doesn't catch. We don't get Matang, unfortunately. I want... Yeah, we don't get it. I knew, even if we had more Pokeballs, Pseudo's catch rates are so ridiculous. Especially already evolved, not even... Wow, I just shook everything with the movement of a leg. But pseudos are so are so hard to catch, especially like if it was a Beldum, which there is on the route before Petalburg, I found out when I trained up Skizza a little bit in between episodes. Um But like they're just so hard to catch. I could have had You saw how it did it wasn't even wiggling. I could have had so many Pokeballs and just wasted them all. It's better that we didn't have any because we didn't waste any. Now we got 11 for our next encounter, though. Boom. But yeah, but yeah, but yeah, but yeah. There's actually... Oh my god, we are about to level up in Petalburg Woods. We are about to soar in levels. What level are we now? We're level 9 and 12? We're gonna soar because there is a bug catcher in there who is about to send in a whole bunch of not bugs. So we'll see. We might get really good experience here, but it's same strength still for trainer mons. And it's a Kakuna instead of a Wurmple. But Skizza here against a Kakuna could get some juicy Iggly buff. Here it is. Everybody remain calm. <laughs> 
Igly buff. I have a special place in my heart for Igly buff. Magic carp. Oh my god. When it said same strength, they were not playing. And a cascoon. Something that he probably actually had. And we went up a level and a half from all of that. Our dreams were short lived. We are going to. Oh my god, Taylor. That is not even like weird here, I don't think. But I think it might actually be a little weird. <gasps> I don't know if it has counter yet. I don't think it has counter yet. This won't kill. We just have to make sure he doesn't do that right before the final hit. Oh no, I have no, it's dead. Struggle's gonna. And it was a crit! And Skizza dies! And Skizza dies. Oh my god. Alright, let's uh, not catch any more normal types. I'm not touching that grass. I'm done touching that grass. Episode 3, two deaths. <laughs> this is ridiculous. This is truly, truly, truly ridiculous. No, that doesn't go there. Skizza, you are dead. You are not, you are not next to Clora. Clora, I'm still not taking you. If we lose one more Mon, we will use Clora. But, I am not taking it right now. I might want to though no no we are going to get through these no 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 yes <laughs> see i'm undecided because if we lose if we lose if we lose freaking victor then we're done like we're gonna have to i'm not gonna end it because it's so early i just restart but like if we lose victor technically we just lost the lock and I don't want that to happen. And I'm obviously really... I'm obviously really bad. There are Swamperts here. We almost had all the water starter power. Alright, we gotta make a voice. Hmm, not one to be found. Hello, have you seen any Pokemon called Shroomish around here? I haven't. I really love that Pokemon. Here comes... Okay, wait. We need an Aqua Grunt voice. What's a good pirate voice that isn't like... I want- I want Archie to have the super pirate voice. Like, I want Archie to sound like this, but maybe... Uh, no, I'm just gonna... I was going to ambush you, but you had to dwaddle in Petalburg Woods forever, didn't you? I got sick of waiting, so here I am! You, Devin Researcher, hand over those papers! Uh, you're, you're a Pokemon trainer, aren't you? You've gotta help me, please! Huh, what do you think you're doing? Uh, huh, what do you think you're doing? Wait, you're going to protect him? No one who crosses Team Aqua gets any mercy, not even a kid. Come on and battle me. What does he have? I want to see him have something crazy, Loki. I want to see him have something crazy. Preschooler Joe would like to battle. Wismer. Dude, the same strength is definitely giving everybody the same weak Pokemon, which is good because we're early game. But, um, we're definitely going to want to, I'm definitely excited for the power we are going to be facing later on. Especially, actually, I didn't do same strength, did I? I can't remember what I did. But we did something, and at level 45, everything is fully evolved from enemy trainers. Ugh, so you've got some nerve meddling with Team Aqua. Come on and battle me again. I wish I could say that, but I'm out of Pokemon. And hey, we have Team Aqua also after something in Rustboro. I'll let you go today. Woo, that was awfully close. Thanks to you, we didn't rob me of these important papers. I know, I'll give you a great ball as my thanks. That is good, because if we find anything a little bit harder to catch, we now have a great ball. Didn't Team Aqua say that they were after something in Rustboro too? Uh-oh, it's a crisis. I can't, I can't be wasting time. There he goes. There he goes. All right. There's gold bats here. Wouldn't have minded a gold bat, because Crobat is power, if you ask me. Ditto! 
ditto. Oh my god, it was a ditto. We learned water gun. Thank the lord we finally have stab. We are going to destroy... We are just leveling. We are on the come up in levels. Oh my god. That's all we have too. I was about to say, let me switch. Can't switch. We don't have anybody to switch to. Alright, we got a netball. We have all sorts of catching power now. Alright, that is not accessible. This is not a new encounter, but we're gonna go and get... We're gonna get these first. This is not a new encounter back here, but it does have a ton of hidden items. So we're gonna get those Dragon Fang! Okay! Moo Moo Milk! Gladly we'll take that, because I didn't get healing items. Nothing. There is Venonats here. There is Venonats here. What am I doing? Nothing. I totally jacked that up. Golems are here. I should have killed that thing. And a Leaf Stone! That is actually not bad. There's Snorlax. This is some powerful grass. Just because of Golem and Snorlax, but... Um, yeah, those are just items. Leafstone is once again a good item to have this early on, just in case. This guy has a hoot hoot. We're gonna, we're gonna body everything. He gave us cash, too. That is more Pokeballs. Alright, who are you? Who are you? I wanna see your name. Schoolboy! Complete opposite. Schoolboy Q, sent in Ralts. Alright. It has to be same strength, right? It has to be same strength, right? Because if they're having all of this... I never knew that! Pokemon Emerald is debatably still my favorite Pokemon game. After all these years, Pokemon Emerald is always the one I find myself thinking back to and wanting to play the most. So, Pokemon Emerald I still consider my favorite. And I never once knew that if you walk through there with only one Pokemon, that those twins do not battle you. Never once knew that. Alright. She gave me some berry. Some Chesto berry. Alright, let's battle this dude. Just for the experience. Um, I think we can get one more battle today as well. Or one more encounter today. As well, so let's try Wooper. Bodied. All right, I think that said God Rachel. I just want to point that out that we just battled God Rachel. I think we can get one more encounter if we just like. Hold on, let's get some. Let's get some stuff. Let's get some stuff while we're here. Before I forget, let's get. We have eleven. Let's get four of those. Let's get a bunch of potions. We'll get three potions. We will get two antidotes. And we're good. Only reason I got antidotes is because that'll kill you outside of battle. Other statuses won't. Alright. Here we go. Try to get this encounter today. Um, I believe we can. Yeah. Just lets us walk right up to Route 116. So we're going to get an encounter over in this blade of grass. Let's see what we get. Let us see what our Route 116 encounter... Yes! Yes! Okay. Kingdra. This is so good. <laughs> Not only are we getting a water dragon type... It might have dragon rage. Oh my god. I'm throwing the great ball. I'm throwing the great- wait, wait! Okay. I'm scared to hurt it. We're gonna water gun it down. We're gonna water gun it down. Smoke screen, go ahead. We just have to watch our health. Oh my god, I got way too close. Alright. We're gonna netball it. Because that does good on water types. Kingdra, dude! That is such a good encounter. Especially since I just made a team for leagues called the Los Angeles Kingdras, and we just got a male Kingdra. I have to name it after a king. I have to name it after a king from the Kings, from the Los Angeles Kings, the hockey team. We're gonna name you after my favorite king, actually. We're gonna name you Kopitar, because you're the dang captain. Kope Itar. 
That's lit. We're ending right there. I don't want this episode to get bad. We're ending right there. Right there. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Um, let me just write that down. Let me just write that down. Alright. We did it. We got a good encounter. That made this all worth it. Alright guys, I'm going to go ahead and end off this episode right there. So if you enjoyed, please make sure to leave a like to show your support. And as always, it's very much appreciated. I forgot that part. Answer the question of the day, please. I would appreciate it. And as always, my name is Cubewack. I am signing out. And I will catch all of you guys next time. Peace.